Yo, 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 it's a gun toting black guy. Whoa, we attended mainstream church this morning. And now I remember why we left the mainstream church anyway. Okay, so the first thing we noticed when we got to church, that they were having this speaker named Dan. I'm not going to say his last name, but anyway, he writes books. So he was the speaker. He gave the sermon. The first thing we noticed is in the foyer area, the com common school area, he had a huge table with about three or four hundred books that he had um, sat there to sell. One book for twenty dollars, or you could get two books for thirty-eight dollars. So. Um, they are political books. He spent an hour and 30 minutes talking about his books instead of giving a sermon. The church has turned into a marketplace. That's why we left and we, we do not go to regular churches because they are not all those people in that church claim to be Christian. If, if I had to attend that church to be a Christian, I'd rather be an atheist. That, that was just completely fucked up. I mean, fucked up. I even said three curse words in that church today. And I would... I, that was not a church. That was not a place of worship. There's two types of religion. There's God's religion, and then there's man's religion. That church that we went to is man's religion. It's what man created, not what God wanted want us to believe in. It, it's just, it was the most miserable three hours of my life. I can't think of a moment when I was that miserable. I felt like I was betraying God in that building. God forgive me for, for going to that church, but I actually had no choice. We're here um, to spend time with my wife's mother-in-law, who's 80 years old. This might be the very last time we see her alive. So we um, we came up here basically to spend time with her, take her to the grocery store, and then um, take her to church. Wow, church, wow, church, wow, church. No, that's not a church. That's false religion. That's the great Babylon that we were taught to keep away from. You heard it from the gun-toting black guy, peace.